SR1 light versus CRKT Clever Girl. MSRP is 160. Oh, 160. Street price 127.95. So from Life Center, you're getting this for one. 130 bucks. Basically. 130 bucks, and this is from Life Center. Uh, MSRP 69.99. It's 59.49. So really, if you're going to buy one of these, you're going to buy this for 60 bucks, or you're going to buy this for 120 bucks. 130 bucks. 130 bucks. More than double. Yeah. Wow. Okay. So. The reason why we're comparing these two is we want to try out the deadbolt, which I'm sure is a very strong, very cool lock, um, versus the triad lock. And these knives happen to weigh, well, they're very identical as far as size, and they happen to weigh almost the exact amount, just under seven ounces, I believe. So this has a G10 frame, steel liners, and a D2 blade. This has a Gribri or Gribrex frame, a partial steel tab, and eight. CR 13 MOV equivalent to 8A still. Okay, so we're gonna do the impact test, just spine wax, and then we're gonna go for the weight hang. So here we go. Also worth noting that the pivot hole drilled in here is three inches from the pivot, exactly three inches. Usually we do four, so our multiplier on the weight hang will be three and not four. Uh, we adjusted that machine accordingly to change for this height. If we go down to four inches, it gets back in there where they're too small to reliably get a good, good weight hang on it. So this is our KT. Uh, there's no play in the blades, or that one anyway, and no play in the SRK. So bo both are nearly identical to how they were when they went in. It, identical. So let's put them on the rack. Okay, so these are just off the spine wipe test. Uh, they both easily pass that with no damage whatsoever. So there's the Clever Girl. Three inches back, SR1, we're starting off with 135 pounds, it should be easy. Okay, I'm going to go up another 90 because I have pretty confidence that these things will do that. usually favorable to test knives that are comparable in weight, size, and price, but we just didn't have anything that, that I could find that matched up better than these two, even though this is basically half the cost of this. Uh, so we'll see what happens. 
probably we should have tested the regular SR along with G10 versus this. Brings us to 315. Oh, that's a respectable amount for any knife. Four or five is pretty good. plates for a few minutes before I start moving the table. I think that's the way to do it. Yeah. But I don't want to move two and moving six. I don't mind moving two back and forth a couple of times. So we'll put one here, test that, two, two. back here. Right. So what is this now? Now we're at 495. 495. matching that 495. Okay. We'll start moving the table now. This is, this is getting serious. What's this? 540. Okay. This has to be close to the end for somebody. Uh, 540. This is the first time neither one has done 540? That one just did 540. Okay. To the recon or the SR1 has to match 540. 
Five eighty five. Five eighty five. That's pretty darn good for a river animal. Yeah. To match? To match, 585. 585. Let's get a twist and that's scaring the hell out of me. Now it's 630. Six thirty. Six thirty. Six thirty. What if we had a tie? That would be the first time ever. But what if this holds it longer before it breaks? It's really, it's really chasing hairs now, huh? Should have timed it. Yeah. Six thirty. For the win. Oh, that's, oh. <laughs> that's scary. All right, winner, SR1. By the first light mark. Do you want to put one more on just to see what we get? Well, we should. And this is half the price. That's the best part of it. Alright, what's this? 675. We take it down this time. Oh, yeah. you think of that? Scientific production. It is a scientific production. That's 720. 720.